back to my channel. It's Josie here. So today, as I promised, I will be blowing up the bubblegum factory. And I hope y'all enjoy. Let's open it up now. Okay, so my mom now opened it with sharp scissors. Uh, do adult supervision when you're working with this. Nice. I don't know what this thing is. I don't know what this thing is at all. So it says that it's going to be a real working bubble gum machine, and apparently it can turn gunpowder into fluid gum. And this is by America's Original Double Bubble. I've had this before. I tried it just in case so I know what the flavor is. So I'm gonna look on the back to see what it is supposed to be. Okay, so I'll show you all that I have shown you. So this is number five. This was the aluminum cup holder. Um inside the front. This is the the insert chassis. Right there. And then the heating unit is right over here at the top. Right there. And then the heating plate level lever is right there. It moves. Wait. So the inside it moves. And then the power lamp is right here. This is what the power lamp is right here. And then the aluminum cup holder is this. The mixing tool, I believe, is this. Oh, it shows it right there. That's the mixing tool. This is when we get to go to the part where Double Bubble forgot what. So, they forgot the pipette. That that's what the pipette was supposed to be but they forgot the pipette from the thing so my mom had to go to the grocery store and buy this little server it's just the same exact thing as a pipette it's just more i don't know and um and then the aluminum cup holder is this this is the aluminum cup and then this is the aluminum cup holder no wait this is the aluminum cup and then this is the aluminum cup holder. So now I could show you, since I showed you everything, well, we ha I haven't really showed you everything. I have not showed you this. This is the gum powder. This is Best Buy, August 2019. We have a long ways to go. And this is the gum powder. It's inside of this little package. There's lots of in here. Okay, so now I got my one teaspoon right here. I got everything set up inside of here. I got a plastic knife to measure, like this. And then I got a bowl to pour the gum powder in. And then I got the little syringe for sucking it up to do the water, actually. Yeah. So now we get to start when I'm going to cut this open and make sure that uh, when you're working with sharp objects, make sure that you need adult supervision. My mom's watching so that I can be careful. So let's get this open. That smells so good. Have you tried Pop Rocks? I think some people have tried Pop Rocks. Don't those look like Pop Rocks? <laughs> so now, 
I'm going to scoop up a teaspoon. Just one bit. So, I can't stop smelling it. It smells delicious. So I did that four times. This is what it looks like. So now I'm going to get a water bottle to get out the water for the five minutes. So be right back. Okay, so I'm going to move this out of the way because we don't need it anymore. And now my mom marked it up to the red line. You could kind of see it. So now I'm going to fill it up with some water. Now my mom did it for me. You can see that it's all filled up with water. <laughs> That's what it looks like. It trapped all of it inside. So now it says that I'm supposed to just put that in there. It says insert aluminum cup holder into the machine into the tracks inside of the instrument chassis. And, it, and then I'm done with that. Okay. So the next thing I have to do is just stir it. That's what it looks like. So now I put it inside of that container. It right there. And then it says move the aluminum cup holder to the right until it arrives to the heating center. Okay, so now it's inside of the heating center. So now it says move the heating pit level forward. So this is what it looks like for right now. I'm scared that it's gonna break. Can I put it in? How about now? Okay. And then it says, so this is what it looks like so far. You can see the mixture inside of there. Now it says, insert the narrow end of the mixing tool inside of there. Oops. Inside of there. And then it says, as a mixing tool, through the hole of the transplate dome. Knead the mixture by making a small presses of the mixing tool up and down. Keep on heating it for 10 minutes. Knead for 10 So, so now that um, it's been 10 minutes, uh, I have to knead it with my hands now. This is what it looks like. So now I get to knead it. Trying to take it. It's very gum like. I'm 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 excited. <laughs> So it's not sticking to my hands. It's very sticky. So now I guess we have it. Now it says form the gum into a cylinder with the flat side of the mixing tool. Okay. I think I may need another aluminum cup for this because I'm scared that it's going to stick. So it really doesn't really dissolve. But now I got to form it into a cylinder shape with the flat side of the tube. So now that we um have done this, after this, we may do another batch, just in case. And we may add a little bit more water. Now it says wrap. So now I have to wrap it up. If I gave this to you, would you think that it's actually like double bubble gum? No. <laughs> My mom says no. So now that it's, um, Form it says wrap it to use the gum. It's everywhere. So, guys, this is the finished result. I don't, it doesn't really look like it's inside the package. That's what that this is what it's supposed to look like. It really doesn't look like that when you open it, but 
the real thing is it's not about wrapping. It's about if it's really gum or not. So let's try it. It's falling apart. <laughs> So, we're going to be adding, we're going to make another batch, but this time we're going to add a little bit more water, because maybe that's why it was falling apart inside my mouth, to see if this time it will fall apart. I hope it does not fall apart, and we'll see you guys there, and then we'll end the episode. Yes. Oh. My mom was right. This is the batch. Is it the right ratio? So good. It's not falling apart in my mouth. So, I made three batches of this. And the second batch it leaked through the box or like the little tin foil and um I don't know how to take apart the machine to make it to clean it and the machine sticky the bubble gum powders everywhere it's just chaos yeah I don't think this was actually produced but I just don't think the machine works. It's just that I don't want to go back to the store and buy another one and have the pipe it not be there again. So if you want to see more of this, make sure to hit that like button. Maybe even subscribe to the channel and maybe even hit that notification bell as well. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.